All right, here's how to import LUTs into both Photoshop and Lightroom. And you have to go through Photoshop to get them in Lightroom. And you actually would start this process in Photoshop's Camera Raw. So go ahead and open an image and uh, make sure you're in Camera Raw. All right, so that's the first step. Now, go to the Presets panel. It's the last little tab here in Camera Raw on the right. It's the last little tab and then click on the new preset button. Now that normally just brings up the new preset window where you can save any settings that you added. We don't want that. Hit cancel, hold the option key on Mac or the alt key on Windows, and now you're gonna click that same button and you get a different dialog. So option click on Mac, alt click on Windows, and you get the new profile window instead, which is right there. Now what you're gonna do here is you're going to turn on the checkbox for color lookup table and it will say, all right, where, which one do you want to load? And so you can click on any one of these to load them if you like. Actually, let's go ahead and click on this one that's pretty bright and punchy, this city tone, and we'll click on this one. And then you're just, at this point, that's it. It's loaded, but you do need to give it a name. So let's go ahead and give it a name. We'll call it SK, what was it, city tone? And then uh, click OK. Oh, actually, we want to create a group for them. Let's go ahead and create a group. So this way it puts them in a folder. So we'll call my folder Scott's New Lutz. All right, there we go. Click OK. And it's going to create a folder and put our new LUT SK City Tone inside there. So click OK. And that's pretty much all you have to do here in Camera Raw. You can go ahead and click the OK button to close this, but we're going to go over to Lightroom to see them there. So let's go to Lightroom and they won't appear here because you have to quit Lightroom. Let's do that and then restart it for them to appear in Lightroom. So we just quit and then we restart and it'll restart pretty quickly, I think here. There we go. Go to your develop module to the profile little button there and scroll all the way to the bottom and there Scott and it's Scott's new LUTs. I only have one in there, but go ahead and click on that. Now, it comes in really punchy, which is why I chose that city tone. Go up to the amount slider up here. So see the amount slider up there? And bring it down and dial in the right amount for your photo so it has that, you know, color lookup table look to it. That's it. That's how you get it in Camera Raw and in Lightroom. So pretty easy. It's weird that you use Photoshop, but it does work. So there you go, folks. Thanks very much.